What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Will Perez. Want to show you guys how I do my Beijing or Biggin. Some people call it Biggin. Um, I call it Beijing. For this particular customer, as you see right here, I already lined them up and it looks pretty clean and sharp, but I put in the dye to give it a fuller look and to color the lighter hairs. Also, my customer requested the dye. Right here I use, for him, I'll, I'll use a black brown to give it a little bit more of a natural look. I don't want it to be like a jet black and it looks um, awkward. So for him, I'll, I'll use a 58. The colors I usually use are from 57, 58, and 59. Right here, I'm just gonna use half of the dye. So I'll fill it up. Or not even, I think it's a, I use like a, a quarter of the dye. And I, I also like to use the Just For Men brush, as you see here. So I mix it up with the water and whatnot. Um, when, whenever you do it, it got some direction, how much water to use and, and stuff like that. So as you see me here, I'm mixing it. And then I let it sit through the whole haircut. I, I mix the dye before the haircut and I'll let it sit for like 20 minutes as long as it takes me to do the haircut. As you see me here, I'm already applying it. I put enough dye where it's um you don't see the skin and I go with the brush against and with the grain to make sure that I get, you know, every last hair. Right here, you see me just tracing the hairline with a dye. You don't want to um, pass the hairline and put it onto the skin. You want to kind of just stay like they teach us in school, color inside the line. It's pretty much the same thing here, just color inside the line. I like using the razor for like touch up. You see how I'm doing it right here. To just to give it a sharper look. And then I'm doing the same thing on the other side. Just putting the dye, um, tracing the hair with the dye. As you see here. When I finish applying the dye, I'll, I'll let it sit in for 20 to 30 minutes. Also you wanna make sure that your, your customers could take the dye you know do it a day ahead of time apply it on their skin a, part, a small part on their skin to see if they if they're able to even put the dye on their head because some people break out um something that you definitely want to bring up to your customers attention to make sure that you know they don't they might have allergic reaction to it so i want to keep that in mind like i said so leave it in for 20 or 30 minutes and then we'll rinse it out After letting the Beijing dye sit in for 20, 30 minutes, I wash it out with just warm water. And then also I shampoo his hair as well. As you can see, it, it already looks, it made a, a, a big difference. It's already looking fuller. So uh, customers happy. And that's the main thing. There's some people, you know, have a opinions about dye or whatever i just try to be as versatile as i, I possibly can to, and just be a well-rounded barber that's how he looked before and this is how he looks after as you can see it gives it a darker sharper look um and it lasts for about a week see here I'm using a napkin to show you that it doesn't come off he could take a bath a shower jump in the pool and be good there you have it guys hope you like the video don't forget to like comment subscribe also got the about that life t-shirt restocked and navy blue red and black peace